What up, friends? I am Max Charvel. I hope you are doing well. And today I will be doing another reaction to the man himself, a leap. Um, I'm going to be reacting to Hotel California by the Eagles. Um, you know, obviously, awesome, awesome song. Um, gets a lot of radio play here. Um, okay. I hope you enjoy. I hope you're excited. I am. And let's do this. I'm liking this already. It's it's a little different than his other covers, you know. Um, a little more kind of a. I, I I feel like it's a little bit older. Maybe I'm I'm guessing by the video quality, but he he it feels a little more experimental. Maybe he was kind of working out his style. I don't know. Um, I, loving it so far. Um, I I don't think in the last couple of videos I I reacted to he did he did um kind of that percussive stuff quite as much. So I'm excited to to see what he's doing here. I've said this before, I'll say it again, he is not afraid to take songs and really change them around when he makes covers. Like, he is not in any way worried about like, oh, I have to play every note the way the Eagles do it. He, he is he is doing his own thing, he is expressing what he wants to express, and that that is like the best thing that you can you can be as you as you cover a song is is you know, I'm gonna I'm gonna find a way to still be myself and express myself even when I'm playing someone else's music. Like super, super respect to him for, for doing this. I, I love it. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> See, that's so cool. He, he added his own intro, right? He just he just adds this piece where, where you almost wouldn't recognize it as Ho Hotel California. And then gradually he just turns it back into the melody or, or the, the chord progression of, of Hotel California that, that we all know and we all recognize. I mean, that, that song is so distinctive because of the chord progression that, that starts it off and, and goes all the way through the song. So he, instead of starting with that chord progression, he started with, uh, I mean something that i mean i can't really say exactly what it was i liked the sound of it but i can't really give you much of an analysis beyond that but it it didn't sound like hotel california so then he takes that and he he kind of gradually morphs it into those chords that we all recognize so he he sort of brought it in slowly very cool very impressive <laughs> I know I've probably said this already, but I, I just want to point out like how, how amazing this is. That I mean, it's like he, he's he's got the vocal line going, 
but then he's also managed to kind of capture the guitar of Hotel California in all its bluesy string bendiness and, and somehow managed to just stitch those two together into a single performance and I'm, I'm just blown away. Once again, he's he's not afraid to um, he, he's not just doing like verse chorus repeat verse chorus you know like like that song has two verses choruses where the you know the, the melodies are pretty much the same it's just the lyrics that change right well he's he's not just playing the same thing twice the way you know I assume a lot of people covering this song probably would he's he's very clearly you know second time around we're gonna we're gonna mix up the melody and we're gonna mix up the chords which is to my mind, the, the more impressive part, because I mean, it's like, okay, you can change a couple of notes in a melody, but to really like pull out the underneath, underlying chords and, and put different ones in is, is you know, to me, a, a bigger undertaking. It's more impressive. So, you know, I'm, I'm watching this and I'm, I'm like, you know, thinking kind of verse, chorus, verse, chorus. Like that, that's how I, I think about, you know, popular songs usually. And, you know, I, I wonder if, you know, his approach is, is just, sort of kind, kind of not even exactly that like I'm gonna do verse chorus verse chorus it's more like sort of you know I've, I've got one set of, of chords to go through it the first time that are maybe closer to what the Eagles do and then the second time around I'm gonna shift some chords around and make it a little bit sort of farther away from sounding like Hotel California but still kind of like that sort of push and pull of like how much does it really sound like the Eagles versus just sound like him you know <laughs> Okay, see, I can recognize that, all right? That is the start of the solo of Hotel California, where we, they, they only do two verses and choruses, and then there's a third verse, but then instead of a third chorus, they just jump right into this, like, absolutely crazy solo that goes for, like, a minute and a half and fades out, and it's harmonized. Um, I've, I've been kind of, like, you know, excited, like, oh, how's he going to do it? How's he going to do it? So here we go. I really like his style. I, I, I mean, it makes me want to, you know, try to learn some some acoustic, some finger style guitar to, to, you know, be able to do at least a little bit of that. I mean, it's it's very inspiring, you know. I mean, um, 
you know, I really enjoy reacting to his videos because I feel like I'm, I'm sort of, you know, learning so much about, I guess, you know, finger style or at least, you know, a, a form of finger style, his, his style of it. Um, you, you know, wow. I mean, it's, it's kind of broadening my, my, you know, ideas a little bit. I mean, as someone who comes from like a rock guitar, or electric guitar background, you know, it's, it's really kind of uh, a bit of a shock to, to see, you know, how he's able to take sort of, you know, conventional songs played on, you know, really the electric guitar. And, and those are the ones I'm choosing to react to, by the way. I'm, I'm picking songs that I'm familiar with to react to. Um, and, and, and just, you know, turn them into these sort of um, compositions of, of, you know, this sort of, um, these, these kind of mixes of, of verse, uh, excuse me, um, like lyrics and, and guitar solos and, and drum beats here and they're all, all sort of woven into this one line. It's, it's, it's very interesting to me and sort of awe-inspiring. Um, and I, I assume it is to you as well if, if, you're, if you're watching along with me. Um, okay, I hope you enjoyed my reaction and a bit of a ramble here and there. Um, I hope to see you in future videos, both reaction and, and otherwise. Um, please, if you enjoy my content, uh, consider subscribing to my channel. And I hope you have a good night and I will see you uh, in my next video. So take care. Bye-bye.